Beyond um, was a study which investigated the use of uh, bosutinib um, in third, fourth, and fifth line uh, of therapy. Uh, that means uh, in heavily pretreated patients in CML, not only in chronic phase, but also in accelerated phase and, and, and also a few patients in blast crisis uh, to prove uh, the efficacy and safety of this drug. And uh, actually, the main data of this study was very exciting um, because it produces in this late line therapy more molecular responses than expected and then uh, other studies uh, have been demonstrated. Um, the conclusion is that the bosutinib is an ideal uh, um, drug, ATP uh, uh, competitor, uh, for the use in third-line therapy. The problem of bosutinib in the past was um, that a very high dose of this drug, 500 milligram per day, uh, produced early toxicity with diarrhea. But if you know that, and if you have an, uh, a titrated therapy starting with 300 and 400 and then 500 and using of... Um, of, of uh, anti-diarrheal drugs, uh, you can avoid this side effects. And with this learning effect, we were able uh, to um, handle uh, buzutinib much better than in the past. And therefore, it's, an, it's a good alternative, a very good uh, second generation tyrosine kinase inhibitor um, in the line with dazatinib and nilotinib uh, to be used as an alternative drug. But it's also, of course, registered for first-line use. That means it can be used in first-line as well.